Today we're gonna look at the M5 Stack Atom S3 lineup of uh, microcontrollers. These are great little ESP32s for doing development work. They come with built-in buttons and switches and lights. Um, each one is slightly different, but let's go over it. Okay, the smallest and lightest is the Atom S3 Lite. It doesn't have a screen, so it's quite tiny. Um, it's about this size, almost like one inch by one inch and really quite thin. On the bottom, you have the ability to tap into some of the pins. Uh, M5 Stack does a really good job of labeling everything really clearly. You have a Grove port on the bottom, USB-C, so you can charge it and sync it. And there is a button that is single click, double click, things that you could do with it. There's an RGB LED in there that you can change the color on. And then you have your reset button. But outside of that, it's a really nice, small, powerful ESP32. So the second one is the Atom S3. And so the Atom S3 has pretty much everything that the Atom Lite has, same pins, same access. We also have a full color LCD screen and you can click on the screen itself. So by pushing and holding to tap on it. Uh, let me boot it up for you. It has some demo software built in. Sorry, when I booted this one up, I realized that I had been working on it with this um, Atom GPS base. And so I'll show you kind of what I had going on with it. So the Atom GPS base module is another module kit. Um, so I had unloaded, uh, set up some custom software on it. So this is a, a small GPS um, antenna and everything is built right inside of here. If I clip this onto the Atom, um, I can squish it onto there and then we can use USB to turn it on. Uh, you can see what I was working on before. So it's uh, looking for GPS. I'm in the garage right now, so it might not be able to find it. So this was some code that I wrote on it, but you can kind of see here the total size of something that can connect to GPS, uh, gather latitude and longitude signals, um, the click of the screen. It has a built-in accelerometer, other features like that. So if you're doing any type of ESP32 dev, the M5 stack collection uh, out the Atom is really cool. There's a, a bunch of different uh, modules that you can get to plug into it. This is just one example of it plugging into the GPS module. And this last one is the Atom S3U. It comes in more of a USB key style. It's got the pins on the back. This would be great if you wanted to plug it into the, say the back of a smart TV or somewhere where you already had USB power and you wanted to create some sort of additional functionality. Uh, otherwise, I think the other modules are a little bit more flexible. This one uh, could work good for a situation like that.